What's up with our idle loans? And where's our 10K? I'm still stuck in reconsideration? The SBA declined me again? What do I do? What's up, ladies and gentlemen? It's good to see you on the Speak and See Show. Today, I ask you like, subscribe, click that notification button so when I get information out, you can get information in. Today, we are going to give the SBA what they want and give us what we want. PPP forgiveness. They're asking right now that everybody, they're wondering why we haven't gotten more PPP loan forgiveness applications in when it's so easy. Well, here we go. We're going to go over it right now so that I can give you guys a quick instructive video and uh, what to expect when you go in there to do this. It's very simple. And I am here with the king of PPP, Tom Brady, who I think I got, I think he got like a million dollars in PPP loan forgiveness. Way to go, Tom. The guy just never loses, does he? Okay, so here we go. First thing you're going to want to do is go to your search engine, whether it be Google or Yahoo, uh, whatever uh, search engine you use, and type in SBA forgiveness or P SBA PPP forgiveness, uh, however you want to put it. Now you're going to click on this loan forgiveness uh, bar that you see, SBA PPP forgiveness. This page is going to come up and you're going to go down here and click on second draw PPP loan forgiveness terms. You're going to click on that uh, little bar that you see right there and down we go. We're scrolling down here until you get to the part that has number three says SBA direct forgiveness portal. We're going to click on that and go right into the portal. You should come into here. Now, when you get to this page right here, you're going to notice you got your username up here and password. Now it may not be your SBA username or password. So you're, you, if you don't have a PPP loan forgiveness portal yet, you're going to want to open one of those up. So you're going to click register to start your request. So once upon, once clicking upon that register to start your request, this right here is going to pop up and you are going to see username, email, password, yada, yada. You're gonna type in a username and password and then confirm a sign up with that. Then you're gonna verify your email address. And when you go to your email address, you're going to, they're going to give you a code. Then you're going to type in your phone number up here, the SMS two-factor authentication, authentication, and it's going to send you to, uh, it's going to send to your phone an authentic SMN token code. This right here, what you're seeing. So you're going to type that code in that they give you right there. And after you type that code in, verify, start forgiveness request. You're going to go click in and to start your new forgiveness request. You're going to enter your social security number here in this bar and then in the other bar to your right you're going to enter the ppp loan amount which you should find on your ppp loan papers and that you want to write the uh, exact amount in there then this page is going to pop up first the first uh thing you're seeing up here is the uh first ppp loan the second is your second ppp loan you're going to go click this select button it's circled in red and this will pop up it's going to show your legal name your dba your uh you know, EIN, TIN, SSN, whatever, phone number, business address. Most of this stuff is gonna be filled out for you. They made this very simple, very simple. You're going to only go in and uh, fill out the indicated mandatory fields which have the um, asterisks next to them. And after you scroll down a little bit, you will come to this next page here where you're going to be putting your, your title in here and your primary name in, into that second box. As you see, that's got the asterisk. So after you click on that, you scroll down a little bit more. If you're unsure about what's actually going on here, you can see these little question marks here. You click on that, it answers the question as to what that bar is supposed to be filled out with. It's a very friendly page. I was, I'm very happy with it. So once you've filled out all of the information that is showing right here, then we're going to scroll down a little bit more and go into the demographic details of it right here. And you're going to fill out your principal name, uh, your principal position, select and select, and you're going to fill those out. After that page, this is going to pop up, no documents required. Um, then you're going to go over here and you're going to click the next. Now, when you get to this page right here, the summary of forgiveness request, remember, it, once you submit, I'm reading this withdrawal part right down here. Once you submit your request, it will be unavailable for changes unless you choose to decline to sign in the following step. If you choose to finish later and navigate back to request, you will no longer be able to edit. So this is like a final step. They're pretty much saying, okay, guys, 
don't it, go check your work. Go check your work and uh, make sure you got it right. If not, then uh, if you're not ready to click this button, don't do it. This is the the final shebang of the request. It's going to bring you into a DocuSign. And where you're going to come up here with these documents, it's going to go in into this page here for DocuSign. I don't know if you ever used it or not. It's very simple. You click that yellow button up there and out, up pops a new page. And with this page, it's going to, you're going to be clicking it and just basically click, 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 click. And it's going to give you the instant signing for each one of the boxes. And you have to sign each one of the boxes in order for this to be complete. You go down here and you click finish and voila, you are pretty much finished. We're going to click it. Here you go. Thank you for submitting your request. It'll have your loan amount on the bottom. I had blacked mine out so nobody would have to see that. And um, that's it. You're done. It's as simple as one, two, three in this, guys. If you have any questions, click down below. I hope this helps. Like and subscribe. And somebody say, hey, I want my 10K. Yeah.